Good morning, I'm Jess and welcome to another food pantry haul. Today, I have quite the haul in store for you. I got a ton of awesome little surprises and let's start it over with the non-perishables. So first off in the pantry section, we've got another thing of, I think this, I think this is an Aldi brand, Fit and Active cereal. Um, the interesting thing is the nearest Aldi is like 200 miles away, so I have no idea where this comes from. We've got a pound of spaghetti, always good to have. A can of um, garbanzo beans or chickpeas, which is one of our favorite quick proteins to have around. We've got a can of peas and a can of pineapple chunks. We also don't have a Rallies anywhere near us, so I don't know where this came from, but I love to have a can of pineapple around. We've got a thing of frozen English muffins. I'll probably stick this back in the freezer in case we want to make a quick toast or breakfast sandwich. We've got two pounds of rice. Rice is our favorite starch around here. We've got a mini bag of lentils, which has been really growing on me lately. We've been making a lot of like healthy soups with lentils and I've really grown to like them. We've got another pound of walnuts. So I've been using these for like salads and baking and I'm definitely gonna have to use these up or give them to my coworker because nuts are perishable and I don't know how fast we're gonna use these up. These are like some stale loaf, like roll breads from the grocery store. I'll probably cut them into uh, soup croutons. I made some pea soup the other day and I've really been enjoying croutons in my pea soup. We've got a cornmeal crust pizza. The last time we had this, we did not like it. The cornmeal crust was just super weird. So I don't know if we're gonna give this one a try or offer it to one of our friends or neighbors. We've got a couple more of these little protein bars or I guess um, cereal bars. These are nut free, which is great because I have allergies. Um, we're excited to try these sugar-free lemon yogurts because I'm really fond of lemon flavor, but um, we don't usually have sweet yogurt, so that's gonna be a little treat. It's been a long time since we had peanut butter, so that's always good to have. It keeps a really long time. And this was a great surprise. They actually gave me 12 ounce thing of full-on Starbucks coffee, like coffee beans. Usually they offer like instant coffee or something and I decline, but today they gave me some awesome ground coffee or coffee beans. We've got some chicken drumsticks, which is cool. I might make tandoori chicken or something soon. We've got craft singles and margarine. Um, I didn't really need any milk, but they were out of eggs, so I got milk instead. Um, they also asked me if I wanted this pineapple orange juice which is great because we really like this in our smoothies. And they gave me quite the selection of um, fresh produce this time. So we've got a bunch of carrots, some peaches, potatoes, onions. Um, I think this is called a crookneck squash or gooseneck squash and a cucumber. I thought this was gonna be a zucchini at first. So um, I might make a lasagna or something and use this. Um, these look like Fuji apples probably which are really delicious just for snacking. I either will munch on these with peanut butter or put them in my oatmeal. And we've got a sweet potato at first. I thought this was a mango, but that's pretty out of season. So happy to have a sweet potato to roast stuff and snack on. So that's it for my haul. Thanks for spending a little time with me and let me know if you have any ideas on recipes I should try with this stuff.